also a lot of luck and which is again you know the reason i don't like dwelling too much on you know what one has done right or wrong because i think if luck is not on your side oh yeah, yeah. you could you could do a lot and still not really get uh, you know very far and um, he said uh, you know uh, you know what you you doing a great job on deal sourcing uh let me try and help you so a couple of my lp said look we'll try and help you and maybe we should have a larger fund size this covid had happened lockdown had happened you know but we were all thinking that oh you know maybe it's uh, and you know, not enough yeah and not enough cases were you know had emerged at that point so everybody is like is this excessive you know and everybody thought it'll all be okay and i remember raising the fund over zoom calls you know if my lps had not stepped in i don't know how we'd have raised it but it was their idea that listen uh, there's a great deal flow and uh, maybe this needs to so then we said from 40 we said 60 60 200 100 200 wow that's how it happened so a lot of our early deals therefore were very opportunistic in the from a size perspective because every time i used to think acha now i'm deploying out of a 60 crore fund so you know your the way you're deploying becomes very different then it became oh we are deploying out of a 100 crore fund so you you know you think differently so and then of course all the challenges of uh, covid so eventually you when was the final close for fund 21 21 yeah and that's when 150 crore was the 150, size and then yeah. then the strategy was that evolving as you went along or? yes and no again yeah so you know um so some of my lps i must say were very supportive and what i used to do is so you remember the gogo years yeah. you know that happened uh, during covid right suddenly valuations were mad hmm. there were i mean you know the country was awash with startup deals and of course new sort of you know categories were emerging there were a lot of conversation about you know like this consumer behavior has completely changed and all of that and i used to discuss this a lot now what happened is that we would see therefore all kinds of deals right in our ppm we had said we'd only do uh, post revenue we said we'll never do pre revenue uh, unless there's some crazy sort of uh, you know exception and we now we you know there was so much craziness in the market that you know pre revenue companies were getting you know funded at some crazy valuation and you know the question i would ask myself is that you know am i going to get uh, outpriced in the market because how do i get into these deals because yeah. ultimately i still have only 150 crores you know and then we also looked at a lot of later stage consumer deals and we looked at some uh, uh, logistics deals as Achha. well and like i said we looked at some gaming deals uh, and we used to ask you know i used to debate these questions with some of my lps uh, you know who uh, are now sort of also our advisors to say that you know should we be doing a later stage deal for example and you know the if you have supportive lps who are willing to bring their experience to the table um it really helps to talk you know and sort of uh, try and They understand can be a guiding box for you right because yeah of, because yeah. because the thing was that it was a it was a moment that i think nobody had seen right and there was just so much madness and you know like when we started there was saws there was fireside and everybody was i mean in their own lanes and and collaborative but also nobody was mad in i mean nobody was doing, giving crazy valuations or nobody mm. was in this deal heat you know that those go go years so so you really needed the wisdom and counsel of people who had seen a lot more and were willing to share and this is what i mean by luck because you know i mean some lps i you know who were my are my lps i've known from earlier they've been friends but in the case of uh, you know some i had not known them uh, earlier but how much they've given of themselves to sort of you know bring the experience to the table so you know when there was a lot of pressure on valuations when down runs started sometimes when you know founders <coughs> would want a certain sort of counsel you know and lps were available to founders to me to sort of help you know think through some of these yeah. uh, and i think that's the magic which uh, makes building something really uh, interesting